Hey guys, it's me Abigail this morning with our new devotional. And our title today is Looking Out for Number One, February 9th. Tom's girlfriend, Leisha, was the brightest girl in school. She was pretty, smart, and wildly popular. He really enjoyed getting to know her. They did it in high school, then college, and then Tom popped the question. She said yes, and they were married. One evening, Tom got home and found Leisha getting ready to go out. He asked her where she was going. I'm going out with Bill tonight, Leisha responded. Who's Bill? Tom wanted to know. Leisha calmly explained that she was dating someone else even though she was married to him. Can you imagine how terrible Tom must have felt? And can you imagine how God feels when we came to be Christians but love other things more than him? Keeping God first is important. It's also something that doesn't just happen. Satan is more than happy to distract us with something that takes God's place. We really have to work at having a relationship with God. We have to make time to spend with him and we have to realize that anything satan offers is a poor substitute for the gifts god wants us to have may god number one today you'll be eternally grateful and god spoke all these words i am the lord your god who brought you out of egypt and out of the land of slavery you shall have no other gods before me exodus 21 to 3 we have to remember god is the first place in our life Anything we do, wherever we go, even for us to breathe, God is the first thing in our life. If he is not, then we're not able to do any of the other things that we do in our daily living. So let's not cheat on God and let's always make sure he's our number one. See you next time, guys.